The municipality's standpipe requires repainting the inside. The standpipe is 14 meters tall and 8 meters in diameter. Three quotes have been provided to paint the tank. Select which company can repaint the tank for the least amount of money. Company 1 will charge $1 per square meter to paint. Company 2 will charge a flat rate of $400. And Company 3 will charge $150 plus 55 cents per square meter. In order to calculate the total cost, we have to figure out the surface area of the inside of the tank. The tank is comprised of three shapes, a circle for the top, a circle on the bottom, and the sidewalls. The tank's area, total internal surface area, is a summation of those three areas, the surface area of the top, the surface area of the bottom, and the surface area of the sidewall. The shape of the top of the tank is a circle. Its area is calculated as pi times the radius squared. The surface area of the bottom of the inside of the tank is a circle as well, the same shape. And the surface area of the sides its formula is equal to pi times the diameter times its height. The cylinder wall sides can be calculated using two lengths. The first length is the circumference of the cylinder. The perimeter around the top of the tank is pi times the diameter. If we were to take the tank and unravel it, we'd see that it is actually a rectangle, where the top is the perimeter of the tank, unraveled, and its length, its height, is the other length. Together, it would calculate out to the surface area of a rectangle. In order to calculate the area of the first shape, a circle, the formula requires the radius. Radius is the diameter divided by two. In our case, the radius is half of eight meters or four meters. Plugging the radius into the equation, the surface area of the top is pi 3.14 times 4 meters for the radius squared, or 50.24 square meters. The surface area of the bottom will be the exact same. And the surface area of the side wall will be pi times the diameter times the height, 3.14 multiplied by 8 meters for the diameter and 14 meters for the height, which is 351.68 square meters. The total tank area is the summation of those three surface areas. Therefore, the total area is equal to 50.24 square meters plus 50.24 square meters plus 351.68 square meters for a grand total of 452.16 square meters. Now that we have the tank area, we can calculate the costs. The total area is 452.16 square meters. Company one will charge $1 per square meter. Therefore, the total cost is $1 per square meter multiplied by the surface area of the tank, 452.16 square meters. 
the units of area, meters squared, will cancel, leaving us with dollars. The total cost to paint the tank charged by company one is $452.16. Company two will charge a flat rate of $400. And company three will charge based on a combination of both flat rate and per square meter. $150 plus 55 cents per meter squared. The total cost for company three is $150 plus 55 cents per square meter multiplied by 452.16 meters squared. The meter squares will cancel, leaving us with cost. The total cost for company three is $398.69, or $398.69. The clear winner, comparing all three prices, is company three. Therefore, company three can repaint the tank for the least amount of money.